Hello everyone, I am Mohit and I welcome you all to Logic Classes. Are you confused about preparation of economics for HSC and you want to prepare this section? Then you are at the right place. In this video, I will clear all your doubts regarding economics section. First we will talk about this section and then briefly discuss the strategy for the preparation and we will also discuss the essential books are necessary for the preparation of economics section. Stay with me till the end of this video and all your doubts regarding economics section will be cleared. And don't forget to subscribe to Logic Classes because the Logic Classes is the best place if you want to crack HS exam. On YouTube channel, we have launched and are launching important videos for HS exam. We have also launched the mock test series for HSC. In just Rs. 1200, you will get 15 mocks with detailed solution and special individual guidance for the HS exam. You can purchase our mock test series from our website and its link in the description. And and and. We are also launching comprehensive, concise, credible study material for HSE. More about it in the future videos. Alright folks, let's talk about the economic section. All you need to do is crack those simple 18 questions in minimum time with ease. It would be best if you begin reading class 11th and 12th micro and macroeconomics books by any reputed publisher. It doesn't matter if it's from NCRT or any other publisher like TRGen. What matters is the content inside the book. If you are able to cover the price elasticity of demand and supply, money supply, balance of payment and foreign exchange etc, you are good to go. And if you find the, reading these books difficult, the best way to prepare is to understand the concept mentioned in the HSC syllabus through the YouTube videos. There are many channels based on this economic section, you can explore them and learn from them if they are suitable for you. After reading these two basic books, you have already covered 40% of economic section syllabus. Congratulations if you have already read these books. The next important part is to collect information about the reputed financial organizations like World Trade Organization, International Monetary Fund, World Bank from the internet. Things that you would be surfing on the internet would be the organization's history, members of organization, report published by the organization, headquarters of the organization and India's rank in the report published by these organizations. And why are these organizations in the latest news or in the current affairs? To understand the Indian economy's main features, major economic problems, economic growth and development and sectoral development, an excellent place to start would be the Indian Economic Development Textbook published by the NCRT, which is part of class 12th CBS Economics syllabus. The most important thing about the GS section of HSC is textbook are not enough. You have to search these important topics which are mentioned in the syllabus which are mentioned in the textbook on Google to gain more knowledge about these topics. And searching these topics on Google can also provide good background reading which adds to your general knowledge and can assist you in essay writing also. And when you do the first reading of these books and surfing on the internet, make some notes. These will be very helpful when you will be revising the syllabus when exam is near. If you have gone through the previous year question papers of HSC, you have noticed one thing that most of the time in the economy session, they will ask for the Nobel Prize of the economies, right? It has been the, one of the favorite topics for HSC since 2006. Either one or two questions come about the nominees or the contemporary Nobel Prize of the economics winner. Do follow these kind of news because most of the time they even asked about the author of the famous economics books worldwide, right? If, if you have noticed in the previous year question papers of HSC. And these famous authors have 70% chance of being a Nobel Prize winner or they are maybe the nominees of the Nobel Prize winner. So search about these important people who won the Nobel Prize on the Google. The best part of economic preparation is that you can kill two birds with one stone. In short, in most of the essay topic, economics plays a dominant role due to its interdisciplinary nature. When you will read the Indian Economics Development book, the 12th NCRT book, you will come across a lot of important details. So you can learn from them and write in the essay section. It will be very helpful and will give you more marks. Try to give as many examples and explanation as possible from economics and including Jagran to make yourself stand out from the crowd. So this was all from my side regarding the economic section of the HSC. In next video we will discuss how to prepare the world affairs section, ecology section and the sociology section of the HSC. And if you are interested in buying our mock test series, you can buy our mock test series from our website and its link in the description. And you can connect with us with various social media handles like telegram groups and channels. All these links and are present in the description section. Thank you for staying with me. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. I wish you good luck for the preparation of HSC. Clear this exam and get into IIT. Thank you very much.